Hello everybody, so welcome back to my YouTube channel and in today's video teacher is filming a Form 4, Form 5, SPM, the perfect email about COVID-19 or perhaps the coronavirus, the latest variant, either the Delta variant or the Omicron. As y'all can see here, this is a simple question that came out in the exam this last year during 2021. Happy New Year, by the way. As y'all can see the questions right here, the cases of COVID-19 in our country are on the rise recently, meaning it is hiking up. It is increasing by leaps and bounds. It is increasing very rapidly. I am so worried about the alarming situation. How is the current situation of COVID-19 at your place? And what are some of the safety measures that have been done by your school? How do you protect yourself when you're outside? No matter what kind of essay you are writing, especially for Form 4 and Form 5 email, it is always very important to analyze the entire email. So, number one, Alison is worried about COVID-19. As you are writing an email essay, you must have a tone of understanding because you are very worried. So how should I reply you? I should also reply you in a very worried manner. As you can see here on the right side, teacher has written there, our tone, it must be understanding. However, what are the three contents that we must incorporate in our essay in order to get a full 20 mark? Number one, we have to tell our dear friend Alison about the current situation. Secondly, we must give at least two solutions. Do a jara jara, do a langka langka. What are the actions taken by our school? our school specifically, because in the questions here, the safety measures that have been done by your school. Hence, the answer must be very specific. And last but not least, how do you protect yourself when you're outside? Right back soon. For the entire essay, as long as your tone is the correct tone, you are understanding your content, you have written the current situation, the solutions that what are the safety measures you know, your school has taken. And last but not least, how do you protect yourself when you're outside? And the whole essay will be nicely completed. Hence, for the first paragraph, you have to sound understanding. Like, you have to understand people. Like, oh my goodness, I'm so worried about, about the COVID-19. How do you reply back? You can't say things like, wow, good news. You can't reply that way. You have to be understanding. Uh, recently, I'm just... Oh my goodness, I'm, I'm so worried lah, about the COVID-19. It's okay. I understand because COVID-19 is affecting literally every Tom, Dick and Harry. Hence, for the first sentence, we must be understanding. As y'all can look at the green color highlighted words, I know what you mean. I'm so worried. Yes, I know what you mean. And honestly, I don't blame you. This novel coronavirus has left me worried sick. Meaning, me, myself, if you are worried, I am worried as well. For the first paragraph, as you can see here, in a few simple sentences, we are expressing our understanding through words, our dear friend, via this email. So first sentence, first paragraph, done and dusted. Right now, we will move on to the content. So in terms of content, we must answer everything that the question wants. First off, we must answer what are the langka langka taken by our school? What did our school do to like, you know, to like, you know, like protect ourselves from COVID-19? So for the first few sentences, I want everyone to uh, look at it first before I start writing. The situation at my place finally turned the corner. Turn the corner is a very useful idiom. Turning a corner meaning, you know, Things are slowly getting better. Things are getting better at my place. So maybe teachers, uh, children center, we are located in a Teacher center, USJ9. Maybe the situation in USJ9 is getting better. We could use the idiom turned the corner. And if you're wondering, what teacher, we can write thank goodness. Uh. Well, because it's an email essay, you have to have some informal phrases. So thank goodness. The situation is getting much better. The cases are getting lesser and lesser. We could use a simple tongzi. We could use a simple verb. The cases are lessening every single day because honestly speaking, guys, nowadays, if you're watching this video, I'm 90% sure you are vaccinated and maybe you are lining up for the COVID-19 booster soon as well. So first off, we have answered our current situation. How is our current situation? It is getting better. 
What did our school do? Well, the second point we are answering, my school has implemented, has planned out a classroom precaution to keep COVID-19 at bay. This is one of my most favorite phrases. Teacher, what is at bay? What is keep COVID-19 at bay? Meaning, for example, if let's say today, this is like, you know, a certain product, I put it far, far away from me. I am keeping this thing far away from me. You get the idea, guys? I am keeping this thing far, far away from me. Our school, they have implement, they have, they had implemented, you know, classroom precautions to keep COVID-19 far, far away, which I am totally immensely thankful for because, you know, health is wealth and your life is truly, truly valuable. The school has come up with a do's and don'ts list for every student to ensure we must follow the rules. We must adhere to the rules. As you can see here, we have answered the current situation. Secondly, what did my school do? Number one, implemented classroom precautions. Number two, they, you know, planned out a do's and don'ts list for every student. You cannot not wear your face mask. When you are going for a recess, you have to maintain like a certain distance with your, with your friends. Hence, we are giving example. For example, the desk in the classroom, how should they be arranged? Because we must maintain like a, a certain distance. And secondly, physical distancing measures during recess time. Because usually in school, we often study in a classroom. Classroom must have their own rules. We will have break time. We will have recess time. What do we do? Well, we have a physical distancing measure. And last but not least, this is actually an extra point that I'm giving everybody. It is not necessarily to be written in your essay, but I'm giving you this idea to brainstorm better. Hand washing stations are installed in almost every nook and cranny of our school. Meaning in your school, no matter where you go, you are bound to encounter like a hand washing station. You can wash, 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 wash your hand all the time. Why? Because we want to encourage students to practice hand hygiene. Teacher, what is hand hygiene? Meaning you must keep your hands clean. You must have the habit of washing your hands constantly because we can kill the germs no matter where we go. So we have answered the current situation. We have answered the langka langka. And last but not least, teacher has a simple homework for everybody. You can comment down the answer in the comment section down below. You could comment about, you know, how do you protect yourself when you're outside? So maybe one of the most uh, common and useful ways, useful approaches, how do you protect yourself when you're outside? you double face mask, like you wear two face masks at one time, but not the same face mask. But this one is just a simple point. No elaboration needed. If not, there will be too many words. Whenever I'm out in public, okay, what do you do? Double masking. So the simple elaboration would be, well, double masking, sometimes your face can get pretty heaty. Like it's very uncomfortable. But, you know, as the saying goes, better to be safe than sorry. For this entire email, the red color are the elite VIP, the advanced vocab idiom phrases. The green color is like native phrases, like helps your essay to be much more, you know, talking to your friend. You can be a little bit more informal. And the blue color are actually the connectors or cohesive devices. So paragraph one finished, paragraph two done. Last but not least, how do we say goodbye to our friend? Your, your communicative achievement must be accurate. So since we are talking about COVID-19, my dear friend, above are all the tips and tricks to protect yourself from COVID-19, from Omicron. Most importantly, stay safe and mask up. So mask up is like a simple phrase to ask you to wear your face mask. All right. So this is the entire video about the COVID-19 for 2021-22 SPM email. I hope this video was helpful. If you want more videos like this, you could give this video a like, share. And if you have any questions, you could comment in the comment section down below. Teacher will try my best to answer whenever I'm free. So good luck, students, and I'll see you in my next video.